here to talk about general weed control principles, herbicide resistance management, and a number of other topics. Water hemp is a driver weed that we have across the Midwest corn and soybean production areas. There are a number of different pigweed species or species within the Amaranthaceae family, so they can be a little bit difficult to identify. Key identifying characteristics of water hemp include these three things. So we have an alternate leaf arrangement, which means that the branches coming off in the main stem are not directly opposite one another. We also have a smooth leaf surface without any hairs. Then lastly, we have what we call lancelet leaf shape, where essentially the leaf is not perfectly round, it's more elongate. To control water hemp and soybeans, residuals are absolutely critical. We've got too much herbicide resistance out there to not rely on residual herbicides. Boundary is a phenomenal non-PPO option that'll provide excellent residual control with multiple effective modes of action. It's really important to follow it up with a strong post-emergence herbicide, preferably one with some residual activity. In corn, we have a number of options to control even multiple resistant water hemp. We've got Acuron and Acuron Flexi. Now, Acuron is a combination of four different active ingredients. We've got three distinct modes of action within Acuron. All four of these active ingredients have excellent residual activity on water hemp. Halix GT is going to provide some excellent control post-emergence and residual control.